all right fellow so first of all you need to be right inside the Senma 4D 2024 and in order to enable the GPU acceleration first of all you need to navigate to the renderer tab in the top navigation of the Senma 4D and you need to click on this so once you click on the render you need to navigate to the north spaces and make sure you select the red shift in the north space and once you're done you again need to go to the render and uh, click on edit render settings and in the renderer you need to make sure you go with the red shift and uh, you're good to go you can click on the cross and keep everything as default now you need to go to the edit in the left side of the top navigation and you need to navigate to the preferences you need to navigate to the renderer and you need to click on red shift once you're right inside you need to find the system and computer devices we have zero bus id one and we have one bus id zero so we have the bus id one as nvidia geforce gts 1660 ti so we are gonna select this option and for the bus id zero we have the cpu and uh, you can also select that option so i recommend to go with both and for the cache texture cache max gb you need to go with 32 and in the general make sure all these settings are marked as checked which is uh, in these settings the hybrid rendering and multi threading is very important make sure both of these options are checked and once you're done you're good to go you just need to restart your cinema 4d and you will enable the gpu acceleration in cinema 4d and let me know in the comment section if this tutorial was helpful thank you so much for watching this video have a nice day